Hey guys, in this tutorial, we are going to train a model of stock sentiment analysis using news headlines. This model checks the stocks are increased or decreased using the news headlines. This is a NLP based project. The data set stores different news headlines. Okay, so first of all, import all the required libraries like pandas, NLTK, regular expression, scikit-learn, numpy, etc. Okay, then the next step is to import, is to load stock sentiment analysis data and display the top 5 rows of stock sentiment analysis data. Then check the minimum and maximum value of date using the max and min function. Using the max and min function. Checking the minimum and maximum date for splitting the data. Split the data into the training and testing. Training data contains all the news headlines. Training data contains all the news headlines whose date is less than 2015, 1 and 1. And testing data contains all the news headlines whose date is greater than 2014, 12 and 31. Then extract the Y train and Y test labels from the training and testing set and check the shape of the Y train, Y test and train and test. Okay. Then apply a regular expression on the training data. With the help of the regular expression, we are removing all the spatial symbols, numeric characters except the English alphabets and display the complete training data. Okay. Then change the column names of all the news headlines from top 0 from top 0 to top 25 it is replaced from 0 to 25 okay then make all the sentences into a lower case from a upper case like you can see some strings are in upper case some strings are in upper case like c is upper c is upper case p is upper case so all strings are converted into a lower case Okay, then combine, then combine all the stock sentiment analysis news headlines columns into a single column and append a single column into a list using a for loop. Okay, using a for loop, you can see how it is combining. This is only for the index zero. Twenty-five columns 25 features are combined into a single column okay then display the first headline check the length and type of the lines now apply a count vectorizer to convert all the categorical data into a numeric data count vectorizer is a tool which is available in the scikit-learn library it is used to transform a text data into a vectors on the basis of the frequency count okay then define a random forest classifier model which is a machine learning model provided by the scikit-learn library and train the random forest classifier model on the train underscore df data and y underscore train data okay then prepare the testing data it's same as in training data. First of all, combine all the training data, all the testing data means combine all the columns, all the news headlines, then perform the count vectorizer and check the length. Okay. Now apply the predictions. Then check the difference between the actual and predicted data. Actual and predicted data then Check the classification report, confusion matrix, and accuracy score. Okay, confusion matrix is basically a summary of prediction result on the classification problems. The number of correct, the number of correct predictions and incorrect predictions. These two are incorrect predictions, and these two are correct prediction. Okay. Overall accuracy is a 85%. You can say that it's a 86%. Now here 
precision is equal to 96%, recall 75%, F1 is a 84%. Okay. So this is a stock sentiment analysis using news headlines project in a NLP. Okay. So if you are interested in machine learning, deep learning, NLP, Python, Flask, so you can follow this blog. I upload here different different projects. Okay. So thank you guys. We will beat you in the next project.